second year in TSWRDC Manapati. Now I am going to tell you about attributes. The general meaning of attributes is a quality or characteristics. Theory of attributes deals with the qualitative characteristics which are not amendable to quantitative measurements. Here, the quantitative measurements are not possible. That is, we can only study the presence or absence of a particular characteristic is known as statistics of attributes. The examples of attributes are drinking, smoking, healthy, honesty, beauty and etc. And in the study of the attributes, if the universe is divided into two subclasses or the complementary classes with respect to the attributes A, B and C, then the classification is known as dichotomous classification. And next we move to the notations and terminology. Notations and terminology of attributes. For the sake of simplicity and, and convenience, we can represent the presence or options of a attributes by some symbols. Like presence of a attributes denoted by the capital letters like A, B, C and D. And the corresponding opposite or options of a attributes denoted by the alpha, beta, gamma and delta. Let us take an example. If A indicates the literate people, then the alpha indicates illiterate people. And if beta represents males, then the beta is represents females. And let us take an another example for C. If C rep represents healthy people, then the corresponding delta, sorry, gamma represents the unhealthy people. And the combination of different attributes is denoted by like this. Here A indicates a literate people and B represents the males. Here 